Here's how I can make this fully editable, non-destructive, isometric text here in Illustrator. Step one, let's select the type tool. Let's scale this up. And I gotta go with the nickel gothic font. Let's go to the Pathfinder. If you don't have it, you can go to Windows and select the Pathfinder. And now let's go to the hamburger. Make sure to select Make Compound Shape. Now we're gonna go to the appearance. If you don't have it, you can go to Windows and select appearance. You got it all there. And we're gonna go to the fill, change up the colors. I'm gonna go with orange. Let's go to the stroke. I'm gonna change it to black. And make sure to bring the stroke under the fill. And we're gonna go to the stroke thickness, increase it. Let's go to the effects, distort and transform, select transform. And we're gonna create a lot of copies, for example, 40 and you can increase the horizontal and the vertical. Let's add some more. I'm gonna go with 60, there you go. Click OK. I'm gonna drag the stroke to this little plus. So it's gonna duplicate the stroke and I'm gonna go to the stroke color here on the second one and replace the color and increase the stroke thickness even more. So this way we created a stroke outline that is surrounding the text. I'm gonna click on the stroke, make the corners rounded and now but least we're gonna to go to the compound shape, select it, and let's go to the effects, go to 3D materials, 3D classics, and select a rotate classic. And here all you need to do is go to position and change it to isometric top. There you go, click OK. And here we got the fully editable isometric text. In order to rename it, all you need to do is just double click on the text. Now you're gonna need to double click again, and this way you can rename it however you like. So basically you need to double click two times, or you can select the type tool and just click on it, and this way you can rename it with ease. So pretty much this is how you make a fully editable isometric text here in Illustrator. Thanks for watching.